Assalamu alaikum and welcome all. I hope that you will be happy and enjoying a healthy life. So viewers in my last video I have shared my bad experience of using old seeds and then promised you that I will also show you the good results from the old seeds. So here are the vegetables which I have planted using the same 4 years old seeds and so far they are doing well. So I will show you all these vegetables one by one in detail. First one is sag. These are mustard leaves which we call sag in our local language. For this I have used normal rye seeds. Uh, you will get it uh, over the counter in any supermarket. This packet was with me from last 3 to 4 years and I have used the same seeds. Around uh, 10th October uh, I have just sprinkled these rye seeds or you can say mustard seeds in the garden bed uh, roughly and kept misting the soil. Then within 4 to 5 days they started sprouting even. I think almost all of them have sprouted sooner or later. And now you can see their growth almost after one month. Look at the size of the leaves. In this portion also I have planted mustard leaves and I will show you that still some of the seeds are sprouting. It is not like uh, the seeds from the same packet will sprout at the same time. See this tiny fellow. It is still coming up. And on the other side uh, see these ones are sprouting still. They just have mother leaves yet, no true leaves. So cute and tiny. And the other ones are grown taller and bigger. And why they are becoming leggy, let me tell you that also. It is due to lack of sunlight. Actually it is a well lit area, but direct sunlight stays here only for 2 to 3 hours, especially during winter season. And I think uh, due to the same reason, uh, even my plants comparatively take a little longer to reach maturity and produce fruit. So even I don't expect to see fast results from them. Here I have planted methi seeds, I mean funigrix seeds. Uh, in fact, these are mixed seeds. Uh, I have told you before that few of my seeds got mixed up. Uh, so these ones I have just sprinkled here. It has some turnip seeds uh, which is shaljum and uh, these are methi leaves. But methi leaves I think are not doing very well. Uh, they are too small in size. They should not be like this. So I might take them out soon. Here is my spinach which is doing really well mashallah and I wasn't expecting this result. I just planted it here to experiment because uh, last time when I tried the same seeds in last week of September almost in that uh, egg tray if you remember that video and that time uh, these seeds have disappointed me badly but as you know I keep trying so in second week of September I decided to plant this nicely sprouted ginger in this raised bed uh, which is filled with uh, organically rich soil mix at the same time, I thought of giving another try to these spinach seeds. So I have just sprinkled here the same 4 years old spinach seeds. And now here is the amazing result in front of you after one month. It might be due to the organic soil or the change in the temperature. But whatever the reason was, I am really happy with the result, alhamdulillah. Even here I have shifted the seedling of beans. For this also I used 3 to 4 years old beans and uh, here I have planted uh, around 4 to 5 bean seedling. They are also growing nicely. Uh, in between here you can see ginger growth also here and here this one. I have planted uh, around 7 pieces altogether. And then rest all what you can see is the spinach. And here I have planted uh, white radish which is called mooli in our language. I actually put these uh, old radish seeds in a ziploc bag to test if uh, they are still useful or not. Uh, and luckily they sprouted. Then I have planted them directly here. I mean those little saplings I planted here. 
now they are doing well but as they were very old seeds so i am not sure about the fruit anyway so far it's doing good and here under this firebush plant uh, i am experimenting with 4 years old carrot seeds i actually want to show you that uh, not only in garden beds but you can get good results in the pots also see they are looking like coriander leaves but in fact this is carrot again i will say that so far they are doing well and let's hope and pray for the fruit from the almighty and viewers keep in mind that plants grown from the old seeds can give up at any stage because they usually lack in immunity and are more prone to diseases that's why i'm not sure about the results of my plants yet but yes i have taken a big risk so for now i have shared all my good and bad experiences of using old seeds so that you can decide for yourself keeping all these factors in mind at the end i would say that if you have stamina to try again and again and you are ready to take risk just like me then go ahead with your old seeds otherwise buy new seeds or ready seedlings from the nursery every year i wish you best of luck for this veggie season i will inshallah show you the update of these vegetables soon till then take good care of yourself stay blessed and allah hafiz